How's it going everyone? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video we are going to be talking about glitch effects in Adobe CC Express. Uh, glitch effects look really clean and we're going to be showing you how you can do that. So we're going to be first adding it to text and then objects. So first thing is what you want to do is to add your text and we're just going to name this glitch. Now I'm going to change this font to um, a font that I have that uh, fits really nicely. Uh, such things like this font, like really big fonts like this look really good. But we're gonna go with this um, one called, if I can find it. So yeah, what we're gonna do first is we're gonna duplicate this two times. So we're gonna put one on the side and like this. So we're gonna change the color of both of these to um, the designated colors, which is hot pink and light blue. And now we're gonna just put this on top of the original text and it should snap on correctly. And now what we're gonna do is to um, move it to the right two pixels. Uh, if you're on computer, you can use the arrow keys. And if you're on mobile, you can use the adjust uh, tab, which has the like nudge option. So yeah, we're gonna nudge it two pixels to the left. One, two, and now we're gonna bring this uh, behind the original text layer, and yeah, we're gonna do the same thing but to the right with the hobby. So one, two, and then just drag it below. And yeah, that that looks pretty good. But if you want a bit more depth, uh, click on your uh, pink color layer and just move it up one, and, uh, and for blue, just move it down one. And yeah, that just looks pretty nice. So now moving on to objects, we're gonna um, just find a random a few minutes later. Alright, so we're gonna do the exact same thing. We're gonna just create another one, for another one, duplicate this again, and yep, like this. And we're gonna just move it to the right, one, two, and move it down, move it up one, and just drag this below, and one, two, and one, and yep, drag this down below. And a cool thing to know that for objects, you can actually do something called uh, blending. So you can just, this has a um, short screen, yeah, to give it a more of a like glitch feel. So yeah, that's something to consider. And we're gonna group this by dragging over it. And this applies for mobile and this uh, computer. So yeah, and that's looking really nice. And yeah, we can just position this. And yeah, that looks really nice. So if you guys enjoyed this video and find this video helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribe. We are on our way to 600 and I know it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!